Middle school is crazy. Oh, I forgot. I was even thinking about that, bro. I really gotta know. You 19 years old. You grown. Woman shares video catching 19-year-old woman in bed with her 13-year-old son. Now she 19 with a 13-year-old? Are you kidding me? Are you that down bad? But 13, you know what I'm saying? 13 and you're 19. About to be 20 years old and you with a 13 year old. How down bad do you have to be? If you watch this right now on YouTube, we are live on Twitch as we speak. The link is down below. The kid RJ with two Ds. Make sure y'all come on over, slide on over, come check us out. I appreciate all the orders. I love all y'all. I appreciate all the orders on sololifestyle.shop. You guys have been going crazy. If you guys don't know, that is my clothing brand. The link is also going to be down below if y'all want to go check that out. We got some hoodies, sweats, t-shirts, all that. But without further ado, but let's go ahead and get into this right here. Like, you thought I was capping, bro. And we got proof of the actual video as well. There's proof of the actual video as well. So she got caught in 4K. But how bad did she get caught in 4K? Woman shares video catching 19 year old woman in bed with her 13 year old son, bro. What? What's good, AJ? We about to check this out right here. It says, this mother was left shocked <laughs> after she caught her 13 year old son doing something no mom wants to, wants to happen to their teen. <laughs> hey, be honest. Is any of y'all got caught by y'all parents? <laughs> any of y'all got caught by y'all parents, bro? Be honest, bro. Sharing her story on TikTok, the mom captures her shock and horror as she picks out a woman who she found in her son's bed. In the, video, in the TikTok video, the mom catches her 13-year-old son with a 19-year-old woman in his room. Now, is that a W for the son and an L for the shorty? Let's be honest here, though. Be honest here now. <laughs> be honest here. So the video is right here. Okay. This is in the viral video. Okay, so here is the video right here, but let's see what else it says. So it says, first start, dog walker. <laughs> I'll let her live. <laughs> yo, hey, yo. In this video, the TikToker confronts the 19-year-old woman, warning her that she should have known better than to hang out with minors and asking her to leave her home. So here it is right here, bro. You hate school? I feel you, AJ. I feel you, man. You in school right now, watching the live? <laughs> I'm just, I, I just, I really, I got to know how you feel like this shit is okay. I really gotta know. I really gotta know. You 19 years old, you grown. She really caught her, like, real life caught her in the act, yo. This is crazy. I got you, Kyle. I'm gonna get on that later, bro. So hanging out with fucking kids, let alone yeah. coming in somebody's house. Oh, man. Oh, man. He what? He told me he could have company. Shorty, you know he 13. You know what I'm saying? 13, 14. Talking about I what? Don't don't try to make this. She's really trying to find an excuse right now. Nah, that's crazy. He could if he spoke to me, but not no grown ass fucking woman. Grown is crazy. You're grown. Right, right. You're not 14. Right, right. That's all she just said is right, right. But as a grown ass woman, you should have knew that that shit sound like some bullshit, right? It's facts. Let's be honest. Even if he did tell you he could have company, you grown, so you should know better. The fact that she's really trying to make an excuse, it don't even matter. Shorty, you're grown. Grown as hell. And what you, what you doing? What are you doing? <laughs> hey, yo. Hey, come on now. We got going on here. Let's see. And there's also a part two. We're going to check into that, too. But let's just, just keep, let's keep, see what we got going on right here. Then to come up in somebody's fucking house. And then on top of that. Mom ain't playing, instead though. Instead of getting the fuck up out of here, it's 11 o'clock. 11? In the morning? She slid over before school? What, what's going on? Not even before school. Well, I probably wasn't in school, but it's 11 o'clock. Can you over here? If you go try to sneak over. And be at someone's crib, you ain't gonna wanna go during the daytime. Is she tripping? Oh yeah, she 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 not. Yeah, she not all the way there. You still here? Still here. Oh, so she stayed the night, stayed until the morning type, and she's still there? Eleven? I ain't gonna lie. Any sneaky link, any of that come over to the crib. Once that nine, ten o'clock hit, you out of here. What are you doing? You ain't gonna be staying in my crib. Hell no. Nah. That's where you lost me, chat. That's where you lost me. Like this nigga pay bills. This is my motherfucking 
niggas in fucking middle school. Damn, middle school is crazy. Oh, I forgot. I was even thinking about that, bro. She's nineteen and he's thirteen, so she's out of high school and he's in middle school still. He still got freshman, sophomore, junior, senior year. That nah, that is wicked. It's getting a little wicked now. They is she's tripping. Now, if I was the mama, I ain't gonna lie. First thought, dog walk her out. I ain't gonna lie. That would have been the first thought. That would have been the first action. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Hold on, this is crazy. Hurry up. For real. Because I'm trying to be patient and I'm trying to be calm. But oh, my mama, you grown. We could be like on some real shit. Yeah, like like low key, they she could throw the friendly. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> They can low key throw the friendly. She's over eighteen, you know. what I'm Saying ain't nothing really gonna happen. Like I mean, when the cops come, she's over the age. <laughs> so I mean, at this point, <laughs> she better get. She better get. Get on. She better get on, man. Please hurry up. All right. Here's a, here's the part two. Here's the part two to this. In the viral video, the TikTok TikToker confronts the nineteen year old woman, warning her that she should have known better to hang out with minors and ask her to leave her home. She further tells her. <laughs> that she was wrong and she was a grown woman while the boy was just in middle school almost 14 not 14 almost 14 <laughs> the concerned mother clarified the situation in a letter tiktok explaining that she was at home with her kids on a saturday morning saturday morning are you kidding me saturday morning when she noticed her son's door was locked mm. He typically sleeps with his door locked. It's not an issue for me, she explains, noting that if she needed to get in, she would be able to. She also explains that she saw her son in the morning after asking him to watch his siblings while she ran to the gas station. So she was unaware he had a guest. Whole time. Whole time she's in the crib. Whole time she was in the crib, bro. Now here's the story time. Here is the basic the story time on it. Let's see. All right, so TikTok removed the video for bullying and harassment. I'm not sure who I was bullying or harassing, but um was it though? I don't think it whatever. was. Whatever. So story time about how I discovered this 19 year old woman in the bed with my 13, almost 14 year old. Almost 14 is crazy. So it's Saturday morning. I get up about 8 30. I'm cleaning up my house. I'm moving around, I'm doing what I always do. Got my music playing, whatever, cleaning up. I check my son on the way, you know, down or whatever. Door is locked, which is typical. He typically sleeps with his door locked. It's yeah, not... like typically I sleep about door locked too, you know, so I always, you know, keep the door locked. But an issue for me because if I need to get in his room, I know how to get in his room. Um, door is locked. So I'm like, all right, cool, I'll go clean up. About So where did they get 10 o'clock? Where did they get caught? I knock on the door. Um, I'm like, you know, I, I'll knock on the door and I'm and I'm I call for him and I keep going. He comes out of his room. I'm like, I need you to sit with your sister. Um, I have to run up to the gas station. Um, when I'm cleaning up my house, I like to burn incense. I didn't have any incense. And so I um, I asked him to come sit with his sister so I could run no and get incense way, or whatever. Bro. So he comes no out, sits with her. I run up to the bro. gas station. I'm gone like 10 minutes. 10 come back, minutes. let him go back to his room. I continue to do what I'm doing. No, no issue. I, I mean, you know, whatever. So about... No way. Mm, this is crazy. 11 o'clock, I go knock on the door because now I'm finished cleaning. I'm looking for my lighter and I can't find it. So I'm like, okay. My lighter was here when I went to bed. It's not here. So two and Where two together. That? So I go knock on the door. So see, the door okay, is locked. So he got it. And I'm banging. And I'm like, what the fuck is taking you so long to open the door? Like, I opened uh, the door. So, though, so she's trying to move around without getting caught. So he opens the door and he's standing. Like right in the doorway? And. I'm like, where's my lighter? He's like, I'm looking for it. I'm looking for it. I'm like, okay, well, you need to find it. But at the same time, I don't see this girl, y'all. I don't see this girl. So, so I go back out. I'm waiting on him. Five minutes later, he's still whatever. So I go back to the door. I'm like, bro, where's my lighter? And I look up, and I see a bonnet and socks. Oh. She says she looked up and saw the bonnet and the socks. So she was just... Like, was she just sleep? Was she still sleep? Chilling? At the crib. Come on, man. What you doing? 
What are you doing? She's under the blankets in the bed. All I see is her bonnet and her socks. And she can't hide better than that? Like, no one's talking about that? You got a girl over here? And um, I was like, oh, no. No, 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 sir. She need to get up and she need to go. Okay? So I go back. I sit on the couch. And this I'm just, crazy. like, a little flabbergasted because he ain't never done nothing like this before. He ain't never, like snuck no girl into the house so i'm like oh my goodness like how am i supposed to handle this situation so i called my mom and i was like you know mom this boy got a girl in his bed like what am i supposed to do and so we was talking and then i reached out to a couple of my home girls and they was all like you know don't flip out just talk not to him facts, talk facts. to her yeah call her weird. parents you know y'all you know, need to have a conversation especially if they having sex so i'm like all oh, right oh hold on now hold on now to talk chill to talk hold on so this is, this is the part two Wait, so she walks back, and they're still in the bed? And they're still in the bed. So I go back to his room, and homegirl's still in the bed. So I'm like, okay, she need to get her ass up. You know what I'm saying? So my plan was initially to talk to her parents. We was going to have a conversation while your daughter is sneaking in my house in the middle of the night, whatever the case, right? That was my initial plan. So This is crazy, bro. Hello, ma'am. Wake up. She was so sleep she gets up, chilling. sleep chilling, rolls over. I'm like, um, so do your parents know that you're here? She was like, yes, ma'am. I said, so your parents know that you are. So a lighter for the incense or a lighter for something else? Because I think she, yeah. Spending the night at a boy's house. That's what she meant. Well, I live with my older incense. brother and my older sister. I said, well, how old are you? 19. Nineteen, bro. And the fact that she just lets it slide like that is crazy. I said, "Do my, do you know how old my child is? Well, he, we just friends. I just be looking out for him. Him and, and his friends. I just be looking out for them. First, looking out for them, or be getting choo chewed by them. Come on, stop it. Are you kidding me? They pass you around the block. They got a five man team, and they pass you around when they just come on. Are you kidding me? First of all, bitch, <laughs> get your, and she's still laying down, y'all. She's still laying down. Get your ass up, <laughs> ma'am. Mama Dukes I, ain't playing, man. Bed, Mama okay? Dukes ain't playing, bro. So she gets up. I said, do you know how old my son is? He told me he was 14. I said, he'll be 14 in September. He's 13 years old. I know, but we just, I said, did y'all have a sex? No, ma'am, I, I wouldn't do that. I'm not having sex with him. You wouldn't do that, but you would bring your grown ass in my mother. In the house, in the crib, laying down with the bonnet, socks, all that. Come on, why you lying? Fucking house and get in my baby's bed, bitch. <laughs> Let me talk to you. Let me talk to she you. She comes out to my living room, and I can tell at that point that she didn't have it all there just based on the way that she was responding when I was talking to her. She was responding like a child. And so... I said, listen. That's tough. You know this shit is wrong. I know this shit is wrong to prevent me from beating your ass. I'm going to need you to go ahead, hurry up, get your shit, and get up out of my house. <laughs> yes, ma'am. Can I go to the bathroom? Did she just ask to go to the bathroom? Yo, get out. <laughs> What's wrong with shorty? I said, yeah, go ahead. Go pee. Do whatever it is you need to do and hurry up. What? Get your ass out of my house, all right? So while she's in the bathroom, I'm just pacing, I'm pacing, I'm pacing, I'm pacing the floor. I see my son's bedroom door is open. His light is on, but I don't see him in the bed, so he's still sitting on his couch. So I walk to his room, and I'm like, well, I said, you need to go get your friend, tell her she got two minutes to bring her ass out of my bathroom and get the fuck up out of my house. Go get the girl, this woman, whoever she is, and tell her to get the fuck out of my what? house. Bro. Mom, why she can't use the bathroom? Okay. So, okay, okay. The video oh, that nah. y'all seen that I initially posted was my second conversation with this woman. Because at so this the point, you asked me could you use the restroom. I was gracious enough to let you take your funky ass in my bathroom. But you Come on. Hey, yo, she didn't have to hit her with the funky. You know what I'm saying? She had to do it like that. That's tough. You taking forever. 
and now I'm irritated because I've had a little bit, a little bit more time, a few more minutes to think about this shit, <laughs> to let this shit really slip in my up. spirit. <laughs> And it can piss me off, so now I'm mad, so now I'm coming back to holler at you. You know what I'm saying? Like, what's up? What, what's your, what is your mindset? Why are you in the house? For so, I'll go back to his room and... Okay, so... That was another... Video. Okay, it's a part three. The part three. It's to the part three now. All right, so part three. Part three, bro. You got to see this. This is part three now. Basically, what happened was... I mean, after after, you know... Um, I asked her to leave that that final time. She pretty much was like on her way out. Okay, um, so she left. She, she left. left before the police got here the because I absolutely got... did call the police. Oh, so she called the cops on the girl that was nineteen years old and messing with a thirteen year old boy, bro. Mm -mm. I hope she did. She would have got caught. Too. She's over the age, so I mean that's that at that point, a lot could go from there. You know, say so if y'all know about you know all that, I can't say too much because I'm live on TikTok. But just know you can get so you can't even go around school. Like if you get caught and stuff like that, you can't go around schools. You can't be around people under the age, and all your information is put out there on the internet, where you live, who, who you're associated with, all that. If y'all don't know about that, that it's it's yeah. Yeah. Um, they came. They asked a few questions. They got my information. Um, they asked my son what her name was. He gave the name that he knows her by. I don't probably know this woman. Her, probably wasn't her real name. Um, I tried to pull my ring camera to give them a picture of her leaving my house. For some reason, ironically, every video is on there and every video is saved except for the video of her leaving except my house. Except so. so she got saved. She got saved. She better hope she don't get in no more situations like that again. Cause I'm telling you, like that, getting caught with something like that for real, it, it it's a it's bad, bro. Like, you it's bad, bro. I don't know how to, you know, they're gonna have to do their due diligence to find out who this lady is. Um, I did my part as a parent. Um, I had a conversation with my son. I let him know w that moms, though, you know. Moms. We, we've had conversations. You get what I'm saying? We've had conversations surrounding this type of topic before, not dealing with a woman of her age. But we definitely like, sat down and had a conversation. And, and I definitely like did my due diligence right. as a parent to okay, make sure that she moms, knew how I parent. felt, that my son knew how I felt, and that the police are involved. Um, if I can find the video Damn, of the police, I may post it. But uh, I don't feel the need to have to prove anything to anybody. Um, there's a lot of stuff being said in the comments. Um, and to be honest, I'm not going to explain my parenting or my choices or anything to anybody. Um, nah, well, see, that's facts, though. The son definitely talked about, for some reason, every video that gets recorded but that one. Who do you think did that, bro? The son definitely, definitely deleted that video, saved her. But uh, she didn't definitely chill out, though. She didn't definitely chill out, though, bro. She get caught for real. It's over. Her life is done with. So what y'all what y'all thinking about that, chat? What y'all thinking about that? Hey, once again, if y'all watching this on YouTube, we are live on Twitch. The link is down below. Make sure y'all go check out the clothing brand. The link is down below. We've been selling out. I appreciate all the cops and all the orders. But nah, this is wild, bro. This is a little bit different. Let me know what y'all think about this. If you were in the sun situation, what would you do? What would you have done? You know what I'm saying? And how would you have felt? Let me know.